Hey, what's up everybody? It's me, Keys, back with a brand new video. And uh, today I'm going to be showing y'all a video that I watched the other day that I thought was just so insane. Um, as a, a couple days ago, I made a video about a certain situation. Uh, there was a certain well-known person who used to be on YouTube was uh, trying to get his hands on something again. Um, you know, they were trying to they were trying to get some cupcakes. Um cupcakes meaning thirteen year old girl, right? Um and so like what's to say watching that situation go on with all that stuff and everything, it kinda of fell I kinda of fell into a rabbit hole of predator to catch videos. And the one of the ones I've mostly been watching lately is uh videos uh, by a uh, Skeeter Jean. Um I'll put like a little thing right here show y'all what I mean but uh he's got some really good videos and he's got some videos on on YouTube and then he has some videos on Rumble and this video I happen to watch on Rumble so I want to uh share this with y'all and just kind of like talk about how crazy the whole situation was so with that said we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get right into it all right, boys. It's uh, your boy Skeet Hansen here. Right now, we're waiting outside the uh, mire for a potential predator here. His name is um, his name is Lewis, I believe, or Paul. He's told the girl his name is Paul, but uh, he's saying that he's 17 years old. But I'm I'm not buying a word of it because when I first started talking to him, I said, "Are you okay with me being younger?" And then he said, "As long as you're 18." And after I told him I was 13, he said, "Actually, I'm 17." So uh, his plan right now is to meet this girl in this mire and bring her to a uh, to a motel that is his uncle owns supposedly. You know this, this guy has you know all the connections in the world apparently. So, uh. all right. So right here, Skater Jean introduces us to this uh, person, um, and already things are kind of a bit odd. The person in the chat says, you know. They tell the girl, you know, they can't do anything, you know, you know, they can only do stuff if she's 18 and older, you know, right? And of course, you know, she tells him she's 13. And then he's like, oh, all of a sudden I remember I'm 17. So, uh, see, already things are not adding up. It's just you know, weird. Like, why would you say that, like, oh, if, if we're going to date or... Uh, whatever you got to be 18 or older and then she's like i'm 13 and now all of a sudden her age is okay and you're 17 all of a sudden so you can see uh things are kind of weird and it kind of gets a little like not too weird but uh some interesting things happen so let's continue on you guys on youtube video or something what's that you guys on youtube video uh yeah we're basically just like documenting everything yeah i just kind of kind of just walk around and you know yeah i get it yeah you know what i mean what are you doing looking for some pants so some pants what kind uh, i don't know champion maybe champion champions are pretty good i mean it matches your hat you know yeah i know that's i yeah. uh, we shop here because oh, yeah where are you from me yeah Ipsy where, where is it Ipsy it's lanny okay it's, it's not that is, is, is this you no that's not is me. that you why <laughs> You sure it's not you? Yeah, that's not it. Kinda, me. It kind of looks like you. No, dude, that's why. Well, someone was supposed to supposed to be meeting me here. Keep holding your mask and show me. Uh, no, I'm not Do taking you, off my mask. Oh, sorry. so you so you don't have like a mustache or anything like that? No. Well, it kind of looks like you. Yeah, I mean, no, it's, it's not, not you. No. Oh, so your your name's not uh, Lewis? No. No. What what's what's your name? My name. Wait, what, why? Oh, why I'm actually with the I'm with the Predatory Investigation Unit. What is that? Uh, it's a we're a privately owned and operated organization that uh, catches adults who try to yeah, meet up with uh, children online. Oh, okay. And we do work in conjunction with the police. Oh, I see. So, yeah. You so, so, so that in that picture is not you. No, that's not. And what you're not willing to, to show me, prove no, to me I'm that sorry, but you're not willing to disclose that it, that it isn't you. That's not me. But all right, so they meet up with the alleged predator. And he actually approaches them first. I'm kind of confused because um, I wasn't sure if that's who they were looking for at first when I was watching the video. Because it just seemed like a random person that walked up to him. And that's, that's pretty much what happened. So he asked them about, like, you know, are they filming a YouTube video? They say, yeah. 
And he starts talking to the skater, you know, shows the pictures like, is this you? The guy says no, of course, you know, sometimes they say no, sometimes they say yeah. Now, the thing is, he's wearing a face mask, so of course, skater asks him politely, you know, if you mind pulling down the mask, prove it's not him, you know. Because the picture that they had shown earlier showed that he had a mustache and everything. And, of course, the guy refuses to, you know, prove that it's not him. You know, because, of course, he knows it's him in the picture, right? Um, but, like, it, even if, like, it was true that it was not him, like, it would literally take you, like, one second. Just, like, here, not me. Look, no mustache, no goatee, not me. And, of course, you could shave and everything, but... You know, but just the fact, and, he, and this person does this a lot, like, anything that would be an easy get out from the situation if he was telling the truth, he just doesn't take it. He just refuses it, you know, because, of course, he's lying. Um, he's lying about his age, and he's, we're going to see some other lies uh, come up later. So, let's get back into it. This is obviously okay, you in the like picture. I'm 16 years okay. old. Okay. You're what? I just wanted to hang out. You're 16 years old. Yes, I'm 16. I have my school ID and my card to prove it. You do? Yes, I do. And because you kept changing the story up, you know, quite a no, quite a I, bit. I, I, we, you want to go to my car and you said, I'll literally prove it. No, no, no. We, we don't need to go to your car. We just it looks looks here to me like like so so, so that is you in the picture. Yeah, then. yeah. Okay, so now you're now you're being real. Yeah, now okay. I'm being real because I mean at first you guys okay. like freaked me out. I was yeah. Like, what? Okay. So who who are who are you here to meet then? Huh? Who, who are you here to meet, then? I mean, I guess the girl's name was, like, Maggie or something. Her name, yeah, her name was Maggie. And how old did she tell you she was? Uh, on her profile, it said she was 18. Okay, how old did she tell you, though? I don't recall though? her ever telling me. You don't know, recall her telling you an age? She said she was younger. Okay, well, I have to refresh your memory here. Uh, she did say that she was 13 uh, a couple different times. Do you, do you recall that? Uh, no, I do not. I take it you weren't a champion in the, in the spelling bee, because you, you seemed like you, you missed that part. Um, and so... He finally admits that it's him, you know, the picture is him, but hey, you know, there's nothing wrong going on here. He's 16. I mean, he did say he was 17 in the chat earlier, but it's cool. He's now 16. I guess, I guess he ages backwards like Benjamin Button or something. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how it works. But uh, as you can see, you know, he admitted to it. He thinks he's going to be fine now. Um. But, you know, let's keep watching and see what happens. Oh, right. yes, I did. I lied to her. Yeah. Yeah, so why, why, I mean, why, why lie? I don't, I don't understand. It's just because, I don't know, I thought 17 was cooler than 16. You thought 17 was cooler than 16. Yeah. Okay, but, but, you, but, you, but you see that it's, that it's really not. Yeah, I see that. It's and you, you see how it's hard for me to believe that you're 17 or 16. Yeah, I, I, I get that. But honestly, I, I, that I, I, I think you're a little bit older. You know? I, I told you that I could prove it. What, 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 with what do you do you have? I, I told mean, you, I'm my school ID. What do you, do you have? Your yeah, regular school ID. And I went to college. Yeah, exactly. I mean, a school ID wouldn't really, wouldn't I mean, really prove that. It shows when I was born and everything in there. It's, your school ID shows when yeah. you were born. When I was born. Um, okay. My height, my weight. Okay. Which is what? Well, what's your what's your height and weight? Uh, I think I'm five six. Five six. My weight, I'm not sure. Like one, okay. One, okay. So, so he says that he thought seventeen would be cooler than just 16. That's why he said 17 on the chat. And he said he can prove a 17 by showing them his school ID, which I haven't had a school ID in years, but I don't think they have your birth date or anything like on them, I'm pretty sure. I think they just have like your picture, your name, the school, the school you go to. I think that's about it. Maybe maybe some other stuff. But I don't think there's too much like personal information on there. I, I don't remember. But yeah, it just sounds like he's B excuse me. So it sounds like he's BSing and everything with them. And the BSing continues on as we're gonna see right now. So you, I mean you, you you see how it looks from from our perspective. Yeah. It looks like you're an adult saying that they're not an adult so that no, the, the girl would feel a little a little bit more more yeah, comfortable no, I, about, I totally about meeting that. up with you but i could seriously prove it to you oh, okay what, what do you got to do to prove it to me um go in my car what are those you call them up right now? no please don't do that yeah it's a, it's a good idea actually 
Well, well, your mom and dad would be able to vouch for you, right? They would be able to. Yeah. But we'd be able to call them and ask call them. Or we can call the, call the police. Well, if you're 16, then what you're doing isn't illegal, right? Yeah, but so why not just call the police and get it all over with, so we can to get to the bottom of it? Dad, What's that? I don't want you to call my mom and dad. Though. So, so do, do you want us to call the police then? No, it's just my mom and so, dad there. Well, you're not going to get not. any trouble if you're 16, right? No. So let's just call the police. Huh? So let's just call the police. I don't want trouble with the police. Though. You're not going to. You're not going to get in trouble. Yeah, you're so six. You're you're 16, we can just right? Just go to my car and I'll show you my ID. Well, now now, now you're, you're acting a little bit funny because. What you're doing, again, you're 16, right? Yeah. So what you're doing, meeting a 13-year-old girl for sex, presumably, technically isn't, isn't illegal because you're not an adult, right? Okay. So why not just call the police, since you're not doing anything illegal, okay. and That's get them over here. Okay, I'm going to tell you why. I and they can ID you. Okay. Okay, because um, so, do you know so what here. a dreamer is? What a dreamer is? Yeah. Um, and, uh, go ahead and, and I, tell I me. Have I have like, basically like a permit to be here. You, you have a permit I mean? to be here? Yeah, like to be in the United States. Okay. I have a work permit. Okay. And like, if I get in any trouble with the police, like, well, you're not you're not doing anything illegal right now. No, you're not but in still, trouble. No, like it's anything at all. Like even if like I get called on the police, whatever. All right. So as we can see, more uh, BS going on. Uh, they pretty much give them a choice. Um, they can either he can either call his mom and dad. Um, and they can, they can confirm his age, because, like, why would mom and dad lie, you know? Um, or they can call the cops and get the cops over there, and they can clear everything out. And if he's actually 16, you know, he's not technically breaking the law, because he's not above 18, and what, whatever. You know, it's still be kind of weird, but whatever. Um, but, uh... He's just adamant about not having the cops involved. And you would think if this was somebody innocent, um, they'd be like, yeah, you know, let's get the cops here. Let's clear this up. You know, you know, everybody's time is being wasted when, you know, there could be real predators you could catch, right? You know, if you're innocent, you know, why not just do the thing to make everything easier? Like, I just, I don't get it. Like, if you're innocent and you're 16 and the cops come and then... My guess is like, yeah, I'm gonna save that for that. I'm gonna save my guess for like the end, okay? But I was, he's lying, and I think the whole like work permit thing. Um, he, um, early in the video, he said his family was from, um, I can't pronounce it, but they're from another country. Um, he said they don't speak English. Um, you know, he said he's there on a work permit, and he says, um, that. Any sort of, like, thing that happens with the cops would get him, like, work permit removed and, I guess, get him deported. But I'm, to me, that just feels, it, it just feels like, like, I can, like, I guess, like, I could see that happening. Like, if you got in trouble and you got arrested and stuff like that, you know, your work permit gets removed. Maybe you get deported, depending on what happens. Um, but I don't think that just happens if the cops come to clear up, like, a situation. I, I don't, so, yeah, I feel like he's definitely, he's definitely BSing right here. Um, he's a total BSer. Um, but anyways, uh, and of course, he doesn't want to call his mom or dad or anything, right? But he does offer to call somebody. Well, we can just put this all behind us. So, what, what, what do you... Want to have your, your name's Lewis, right? Okay, or, so my mom only speaks Spanish, though. She only speaks Spanish. Yeah. So what about your dad? Him too. You, him you, too. you can call them. Okay. Though. Do you have any any English speaking relatives or no, friends? Yeah, okay. Sorry, I, don't. I, I guess we'll just have to call the police then. Yeah. It, unless unless you unless you have some sort of ID on you right now that you can show me. No, on me. No. Some of your 16. I do. I left it in my car. I guess I can call my my aunt. Your what? My aunt. Do they speak yeah, English? She sort of speaks English. Sort of speaks English. Yeah. Right, I mean, the, no, the, the me police speak full English, English, you know. Like so, do you want me to call him? I mean, if you know, if if you want, I don't know if it's gonna do you know much good. What are you guys gonna tell her? We're just gonna tell her that you're here to meet a 13-year-old girl uh, for sex, presumably, or or you can you can tell her, 
and we can just you know see what she thinks of it. Okay, give me a moment. So right here, he offers to call his aunt. Hey, they're still saying you know they'll call the cops to get everything cleared up. Should be no problem. Be sixteen, right? Well, no, he doesn't want the cops there at all. So he offers to call his aunt. She speaks a little bit of English, you know. So that's what he gets down to. And this, probably these last two clips, I'm gonna show you the phone call, and when they go out to uh to his car, are probably the two like most interesting things that have been in this video. That basically, uh, the phone call had me laughing. The uh, the thing with the car, y'all just wait. That's it's gonna be great. What you're gonna tell her? Well, I'm, I'm gonna have. I just want you to tell her what's going on. Hello? Okay, um, well listen, Aunt, um, I came to Myers, and, uh, there's, there's these two guys that think that I'm meeting up with a 13-year-old here. Well, you are. You're, you're here to meet up with a 13-year-old. Yeah, and, uh, I don't know if they want to tell you. They want to, like, prove that I'm 16 years old or something. So... Hold on. Ma'am, now he's, he's here to meet a 13-year-old girl for sex, uh, presumably. No. He, he, he is. That's, that's, what he's, that's what he's here for. Um, and we're, we're, just, we're just warning because he seemed to flip his age around quite a bit here. Uh, how, how old is he actually? actually? He's 22. He's 22. So you're not 16. No, I am 16. You're 60. Why is she saying 22? Ma'am, ma you do speak English, correct? You understand what I'm saying to you? He's he, he's he's 22, not 16. Oh my God, I'm sorry. I didn't hear that. You what? You heard what? I didn't hear that correctly. Oh, um, he, you 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 did say that he's that he's 22 years old, right? No, 16. I'm so sorry. Oh, he's 16. I well, thought you were asking my age. Oh no 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 his age. So he's 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 16. You're saying he's 16. Okay, if that's that's what what you got what you got to do to prove it. Yes. Okay. I mean, so I, I, I guess I guess we can uh, we, we can get going going to your car then. Okay. Uh, I'll call you back. That was super embarrassing. Well, I, I'm sorry. I mean, you you understand where I'm coming from here. Yeah, but like you know, my with, the, with these things, know, we just have to make sure. My aunt is. So he calls his aunt, but the person who picks up the phone. Doesn't even sound like they're away. I mean, I really I don't know what time this is happening at. So maybe it was like really late at night and they were sleeping. But uh, he explains the situation, and when Skeeter asks her how old he is, she just says with no hesitation, "He's 22." And then he's like, "No, I'm I'm 16." And all of a sudden, she's like, "Oh." I thought you were asking me my age. I'm 22. He he is 16, and just the whole thing. You you just know that this is just somebody that he called. That is somebody that's you know probably you know knows the shit he gets into and always has his back and you know maybe some on again off again girlfriend lover. That, you know, no matter what kind of stupid shit he does, um, she always has his back. So, you know, I, guess, I think he just called somebody. I don't think he called his aunt. I don't think that was his aunt. It, it, it couldn't be. I think he's the BS there. You can tell. He's, he's just, it's, all, it's all BS. All of it. But anyways, let's go ahead and get to the last clip right now. Um, my favorite moment. It's... Um, Bit long, but uh, y'all will enjoy it. So here we go. That's fine. Just so you know that I'm not like the Oh yeah, no, it's it's fine. We're just we're just gonna play number here. Okay, you can. What's that? Huh? Okay, did you want to? Did you have a license or something? Yeah, I'm getting her. Okay. I thought I had it. You thought you had it. But I do have something that like. It shows my name and everything. Okay, what's that? It's a ticket. A ticket? Yeah. So, so now he's driving without a license. So now you're driving without a license? 
No, not driving without a license. It's actually because so my back light was off. Because your what? My back light was off. Back light was off? Back light. It was off, okay. Yeah, so I got a ticket for it. Oh, okay. Can I see it? Sure, that's what I'm saying. Like, you can see it. Okay. But I mean, like, like, the final objective here, like, how can I, like... Well, if, if, you're, well, if you're actually 16, then, you know, no harm done. Uh-huh. And we'll just forget all about this whole thing. But I don't have any ID here to prove you. You don't have any, any sort of ID on you? No. Okay, we'll, we'll just call the police then. For safety purposes. Yeah. We don't want to. Here. You, you yeah, just, we just don't want to. I mean, ticket doesn't do anything. But I mean, it shows when I was born and everything. Yeah, but how do we know it's him? It's, it's my name. What's your name? Luis. Luis? Yeah. Can I see that? Yeah. Number you want. I'm going to call the cops on you. Did he give you the ticket? He gave me the ticket, yeah. Probably call the cops because uh, now he's driving without a license. He wasn't 16. No, definitely not. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, we're doing great. Oh, yeah, yeah, just a uh, bit of confusion here. I don't think it has his name on it or anything. Oh, no. And so our 16 year old has uh, fled. He made a run for it. And quite dangerous thing to do because of where he, how he was parked between another car and the return baggy thing. And Skeeter was also standing right next to his car, so he could easily run over his feet. But, yes, you see the BS continue. He claimed uh, student, student ID wasn't in the car. Uh, did, uh, supposedly didn't have his license, which I think I think was bullshit. I th sorry, sorry. It was more BS. <laughs> Try to keep it PG-13 here, at least. Um, some more BS about this student ID and license. I think he did have a license on him, but of course that would show his real age and he can't do that. And so yeah, I think that's going to be it for this video. Um, if you guys enjoyed it, please, you know, drop a like, leave a comment. If you want to see anything more like this, let me know and I'll see you all in the next video.